Damn, sexy. You can see what the bare legs is off. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Welcome back to another video. Me and my buddy James here haven't fished together in a long time. Oh. A really long time. So we are out here at Coronado. We have decided to do some good old wade fishing right here near the Coronado Ferry Landing. So we, we will be wading San Diego Bay. So I don't know what to expect. Hopefully I don't catch a midshipman. I will try to take off my toe again like I did like two years ago. But we'll give it a shot. So you guys stay tuned. Wish us luck and yeah, yeah. let's do it. So this right here is our base camp. <laughs> yeah, I usually just need to ride there, so we just walk around right here. This is all we're gonna wade. I like this spot because it's small and we're right here. <laughs> I just put new line on this reel too, so let's see how it is. All right guys, it's been a while since I fished San Diego Bay, but I guess making my first comeback in would be waiting. Had a couple of people been questioning me about waiting San Diego Bay, so here I am. I don't feel anything. Really? I do. I'm camping. Frozen right now. Oh yeah, you're using you're using that those waiters, that's why. Mines? I'm pretty warm still. Yeah? Yeah. Last, is that a fish? Is it a fish? I don't know if it's a fish or not. It's been a while. <laughs> no, it's not a fish. It's grass. Yeah, we gotta find a drop off. How deep does this get? Or how, how, how flat before it drops off? <laughs> Pretty far. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, shoot. I don't wanna keep going and then suddenly. Yeah, just, just shuffle your feet. Just shuffle your feet. Cause remember, we're fishing high tide right now. Yeah, so I'd cast to the right. Oh, yeah? I really don't know how the bay has been, so this is literally like a stab in the dark, bro. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I see that. Come on. First wade fish of the morning, fellas, ladies, whoever the hell is watching at home. Show yourself. Not bad. Not bad at all. There you go. First body in like a month. Peace out, homie. The rod I'm using is the uh, Nano Ace crankbait. The reason why I'm using the crankbait rod out here for the blade bait is because I like that parabolic bend to it. It allows me to, uh, you know, to have the hooks penetrate and keep them pinned with a softer tip on these bass out here. Also for fresh water. But that's what I'm using. This is a seven foot five medium heavy Major Craft Nano Ace crankbait rod. What I got paired on it is Daiwa Tatula 150 with 30 pound J braid. See, I like waiting here because you don't have to worry about waves in the morning. Yeah. That was a hit. Ah, oh, no. <laughs> what works really good out here too is Texas rig uh, grubs. Grub? We have to use like a 3 8 ounce or 5 8 ounce Texas rig. Uh. Dude, I'll drop shot them out here. Oh yeah, drop shot all day. There we go. Fish numero dos. Little guy, damn, you put up a good one out here, homie. I give you respect. Respect. 
respect, little fella. Woo, right between my legs. My wife would be mad. <laughs> hey, this purple is outshining your cotton candy, bro. No, bro. There you go. Let it sink to the bottom. Three cranks. Whoop out. I'm on. Oh, that would have been a. That, that would have been dope if it was a macro. <laughs> oh, it's a macro, bro. It's a macro. Is it? Yeah, that's what surface yours. Oh, he still got heart. Oh, <laughs> that was a hard hit. Oh shit, what is it? I don't know. Dude, what the hell is this? He hit it like a tank, bro. Why'd he come up with three inch spotty? Oh no, he's putting up a good one. A lot of head shakes. Who are you? It's a good spotty too. Fatty. <laughs> Little fatty right here. No, he fit it like a train. You wanted that purple, huh? Oh, that hurt. <laughs> if you guys don't know, now you know. All right, got on the purple zebra, 18 grams. Not bad at all. We had some rogue waves come in right now from like the police boat that was all the way at Embarcadero over there. And it finally got to us. And I was walking back because got to watch out for the camera gear. No camera gear, no content for y'all. Oh, you got one? <laughs> there we go. Nope, came off. Came back for it. <laughs> Tons of head shake. Feels like a macro. Oh, some tugs on you. Oh, it's a good spotty. Number three, four, I don't know. I'm having a good time. It don't matter how many I'm catching right now. Wait, bro. <laughs> Get away from me. <laughs> Just so you guys know, if you guys are waiting, you guys catch spotties and you release them right by you, first thing to look for is structure. So cover your family jewels. Yeah, there you go. Killing it, man. That's the best hit. Oh yeah. You know what's nice about waiting here? That veal though. Can't beat that. Uh huh. Dude, see, they've been tail biting a lot and the split rings coming off. Is it? Yeah, check your split rings, bro. The one where the blade meets the swivel. People complain about it, but it's part of the game. Look at that split ring. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yep. It's part of the game. That means the bait's working. It's getting bit. Hardware breaks. Just got to replace them. Yep. But luckily, I brought a box of them. Easy fit. Oh, yeah. I'd just take it home and clean them off. Waiting's fun, guys. So, caught my fair share. He's still out there. James caught a halibut, a couple spotties. I caught a macro, a couple spotties. All on the jig power spin that's producing right now. But if there's a Halley out here, I'm going to try to throw on a grub, see what happens. I'm going to do some Texas rig, a little heavier setup, grub. I'm going to chuck it out there and see uh, see what's popping, see if anything else bigger bites. We'll, we'll see what it is. We'll switch on and off, on and off. It's, you know, we'll try to figure it out, what they like. What if they like both? Throw them both. All right, so hmm. stay tuned.
like a 3 8 ounce tungsten weight for uh, extra wide gap got a zoom grub on you guys remember everything that will be used in this video that actually work will be linked in the description below maybe not link but it'll be in the description below and i'm going weedless so i can get into the grass yeah. got the nano ace worm and jig rod this is seven foot medium heavy rated up to five eighth of an ounce eight to 14 pound line test major craft nano ace and i got the daiwa saltis 3000 equipped with 15 pound power pro to 15 pound floral leader short leader and that's what's gonna not catch me fish today let's see just gonna get my lines wet real quick just so you can cast a little bit easier you, know, you always cast better with a wet line if you guys didn't know that check my drag so that way if i set the hook it doesn't slip and then i lose a fish many times that has happened Ooh, that was a bite yep soft plastics sometimes you just gotta switch it up i love my jig paras but maybe another bait will produce more given the situation or the conditions the T-Rig. I like fishing way you just walk in a circle. <laughs> yeah, a little baby right in the grass. Got him. Little guy. Seems like a numbers and kind of quality day, kind of day, 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 day today. Get no sand in it at all? The boots sometimes, when, but only when you're shuffling through the, uh, walking up. Well, other than that, it's just on the outside because it sticks to it. What about, um, surf? Oh! Nice! <laughs> you saw that? Yeah. <laughs> Not even, bro. I was looking down. <laughs> Ski balling. <laughs> Scared the shit out of me. But I'm talking about, like, you surf fishing. Does sand get in the boots? No. No? No. I was over at Dog Beach, um... Beat never fails. Dinker! <laughs> Dude, that hook messed him up. That hook went in the mouth, out the other side of the mouth, into his chin. I don't know how to explain that. Look at that. Sorry, homie. Here we go. Oh, he's right under my, I just stepped on him. Okay. <laughs> I, I shit you not, I just stepped on him. Oh, he's under my feet again. <laughs> you guys gotta know, they find shelter. They try to find shelter right when, right after they're caught. Whoa, my foot just got stuck. <laughs> that means stingrays are around. Feels like a better one. What are you? Show yourself. Show your face. Oh, spotty. Woohoo! Back up, back up. Dude, this guy's angry. Get away from me. <laughs> Oh, we're not. All right, that reel's out of commission. Oh. oh, he's on. He's on. Came back for it. What is it? Love it, bro. Just waiting with them, dude. I end the fish. <laughs> chill. Chill out. There you go. 
I try not to release him too close to me because he swims. Yeah. Right into my family jewels. Just go pick us up. <laughs> there you go. That was a hell of a hit. Nope. No, Spotty. Spotty. Ooh, he surfaced up. Yeah, that was a hell of a hit because he tip ticked it yeah. pretty soft. Good one. Not bad at all. I'll take it. This one has a little belly on him. Oh, they're a lot lighter over here than over there. Yeah. The little white fluke. Trying to get the halibut to bite, but these guys are getting in the way. Is it? Yeah, dude. There you go. You're, you're just killing the babies today. You're hitting the freaking nursery, bro. <laughs> Putting on a clinic for these guys. That's your third one today. Yeah. Is that the most halibut you caught in one day? No, actually, I've caught in four, actually. Oh, well, well. Beat that, huh? You need one more to, uh, to uh, break even. <laughs> Look at that. Surprised they're hitting a little swell that he took off with. <laughs> no, they're here. It's all those ones that we see dart off, dude. <laughs> I know, right? Mama bear gotta be somewhere. Oh, that was a hit. There we go. We found a pocket, bro. Nice. It's a bass. Look at that lion go crazy, bro. That's dope. <laughs> that is so dope, bro. I need to wade more often now. <laughs> Oh. That's oh, gonna be so much fun, Hell yeah. dude. This guy looked like he got socked in the face by Mike Tyson, bro. Look, <laughs> oh. but I didn't hook him there, I hook him at the bottom of the mouth. Wow, damn, bro, that's crazy. <laughs> Mama said, Knock you out. <laughs> Ooh, barely missed your gill. You're good. There you go, another decent one for the day with a black eye. <laughs> Off he goes. One, one. one what? No. On oh, that messed up vape, bro. Oh. They're still hitting. Oh, I stepped on a freaking stinger. Ah! What the fuck is that? <laughs> dude. dude, they're around here, dude. I keep getting thumped. Oh, it's a flatty. Dude, that thing was huge. I'm telling you, keep, something keep hitting, bumping into me. Dude, that thing was huge. Whatever it was, bro. Felt it, huh? <laughs> oh man! I'm gonna, wait. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go take a break. I'm gonna shuffle my feet as I go. Oh wait, let me let this guy go. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Oh little baby Hallie, hell yeah! Nice. Forgot about you. First baby Hallie of the day. All right, guys, take a little lunch break right now or breakfast break. Got me screaming like a girl out there. I'm telling you, you don't know what's in that water. You got stingrays, halibut, midshipmen. Oh. Things with teeth. <laughs> Things with teeth. Oh, this is chicken and ham. Is it? Looks like the fluke is producing for us. Well, for me at least. Yeah, I'm switching over, bro. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you guys, man. We caught like at least 30 fish already today. Oh, yeah. Waiting. We are like this deep. So that's about what three and a half feet four yeah four no yeah three and a half four who knows short asian but <laughs> we're out here we're fishing the outgoing tide we found a little pocket full of them and they were just on the chew i'm telling you guys they were just on the chew literally could have took my leg out if you guys ever weighed the bay before y'all let me know what was the craziest thing you stepped on or anything like that but i'm gonna finish up this ham and chicken, lettuce, mayo wrap, and get back on the water. So stay tuned. Got him? Oh yeah. Holly? Start walking backwards. Yeah, it's a good one. It's a good one. It's a good one. It's illegal. Keep walking back. Keep walking back. Keep walking back. Let him peel if he has to. He's right there. That's a good one. I'm 
trying to get to it. Right. He's right there. Just keep walking, keep going. He's on there good. I can't kill him. My fish grips are over there too. Oh, that's illegal, dude. Yeah, it's like 23, 24. Dude. Let me go wash my hands real quick. <laughs> Your first legal of the year? Yep. I knew I threw some fish grips in here. There you go. Hell yeah, bro. Nice, bro. Oh, yeah. What's legal? 24? 22. Legal. It's 25 and a half. Oh, yeah. 20. Oh, yeah. Dude, this thing is chunky. Alright, guys, there it goes. Legal first legal Woo, of, of the, the year. year of the year man look at that thing Woo. big old guy <laughs> Woo ah, got me. oh he got me his teeth got me you got you yeah we grinded this morning oh. we're catching nothing but babies oh. worth the wait dude worth the wait look at that oh. hella worth it there you go man hell yeah dude yeah. Your turn. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, man, oh man. He did it, he did it, he did it. I told him we were gonna get him a halibut today. I told him this morning oh, yeah. too. But we started seeing signs of baby halibut. They're about right. like hand size. Right here. Right there. That's right the bait there. he was using. <laughs> right there. He was he, first he was using the what? The gulp? The gulp, yeah. And you were getting small halibut. Yep. But then I was getting a lot of big hits on the white armored shed by the Miki. And sure enough, I was like, dude, you need to try this. Here's a kind. Couple that's, casts in, boy, and I hooked up to that one. There you go. Ooh, that's Texas the money rig. maker. Yep. <laughs> Exposed hook, Texas rig. <laughs> no, it just popped off. Ah, uh, yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Super so This is what it's all about. We just we, we were last night. We're like, you know what? Should we hit the lake or should we fish the bay? You know what? F fish it. The bay. Let's fish the bay. Let's wait it. So let's he's, wait he's never bay. been here before, and I'm pretty sure this spot that I took him to right here, Coronado. It's gonna leave a sweet taste in his mouth and he's gonna try oh, to yeah. come back for more. Oh yeah. All right, so we're gonna get cleaned up right now. All right, dude, congratulations. Ooh, thanks, First bro. legal today. Thanks, man. First one <laughs> right. of the year. First one of the year, yeah. All right, guys, stay tuned. All right, guys, we are summing up the video right there. Thanks a lot for tuning in. But a quick summary, we did decided to go waiting last minute last night literally like at 8 7 p.m and we decided you know what lake or bay bay wade or rocks wade so we came out ended up waiting coronado San Diego bay on the coronado side and he ended the day with a kicker we started off the day but guns blazing the oh, bite yeah. was on and cracking dude oh, we caught yeah. easily like 30 35 fish between four us two species, yeah four different species yellowfin croaker macro halibut stingray by my foot <laughs> and <laughs> and uh spotty of course but yeah we're gonna end it right there dude the white fluke was the ticket first it was the jipara spin we were killing it with that in the beginning then the bite died for that so we switched over to curly tail flukes and he was using the gulp and we're still getting them but i told him dude i lost a decent one yeah. on the fluke so he's yeah. like you know what let's tie it on and try it out and he did and sure enough he got paid off it paid off paid he got off. gifted with a 25 25 and a quarter, and a quarter bro hell of it Woo! so shout PB. out to him his first legal of the year and his pb so let's see if we can try to break that this year or next year or five years from now <laughs> who knows know. we're gonna close it out right there guys thanks a lot for watching as always good fishing and peace out Ooh.